Hello, today I will show you how to implement very simple text with hump icon on Ulanzi TC001. So, this is my home assistant and inside of it I have an Android add-on installed. If you have no idea how to connect everything, please watch my previous tutorials about this. So, there is everything what you need to configure it step by step. So. I will click now no dread and I will show you a simple flow that you can use to display subs on your uh, device and I'm going to uh, present it so here is the injection node so run every 10 minutes here is the function node it's quite easy um, all you need to do um, is to type text to send like and subscribe in this case then text to send and icon so the icon is the thumb icon duration that's 10 seconds and after that it is everything what you need and at the end there is a mqtt out node where you need to define the connection to the mqtt broker in this case it is a mosquito broker add-on for mqtt inside home assistant and that it uh, after that uh, you need to deploy it uh, using this button and then hit it here so you should be able to observe it here i will just um show you this uh, i hope you will be able to see it um here we go and this is it so I will try to like that give you a overview there we go on my panels and like and subscribe you can see this is exactly it so you can do something like this um, I will provide a uh, node red flow on my website so you will be able to just copy and paste it into the node red and i will show you how to make it work it's quite easy thing um what you need to do um, is just to click on this menu here and choose import and here paste the flow so first of all i will show you how i can export it quite easily i can just select all of it and then hit the menu one more time but this time export select current flow and copy the clipboard so i can paste it to my website and then i will show you how it looks like so i will click it once again import and Control v to paste this json format F flow is in json format and this is the code that you can see here so all you need to do um it's just to if i yeah this one uh remember to modify this node uh, mqtt out so you need to change the ip address and after that also remember to change the topic because it is crucial so this is the prefix taken from the ulanzi uh, website so i will show you this one where it comes from uh, this is uh, it so let's log in there and after that if you will click here you can see there is a prefix and this is the something that is uh, generated when the device is flashed so on flashed right awtrix underscore and a string so um what you need to do you just need to copy it uh, to uh, this field so you can see i have this topic here here and here and just then click import and that's it and where it is located here if you will click this one node twice and then you will click the pencil icon here and here is the security so this is the user and that is defined in home assistant user not inside the mqtt broker uh, so we just define the user and password and uh, select the option to allow this user to uh, work only in local area network and there's a message so here is my prefix here one two three fields here so you need to provide it here and also uh, you need to provide this topic here 
and you can see something like customize sub so this is the path for the panel that is displaying the uh, animation with subscription and that's it so in four places you need to change this prefix and what more um yeah and added a security connection here so you need to change the ip address to home assistant and uh, then select this and the security as i mentioned you need to use the user mqtt to be able to connect to this and that is all that's everything what you need um, if you want to change the text you can change it here if you want to change the icon you can change the icon uh, depending on your needs i was explaining many times how to work with icons so i will not waste my time this time um just uh, please uh, find out how to work with icons how to upload proper id here and you can uh, just uh, choose another icon to display it on the screen and that's it this is everything uh, actually uh, what you really need then you will be able to push the text and the icon directly onto one ztc 001 device without any um, problem i will show you how to work some just by copying this uh, not this one uh, the function node i will copy this id it is picked up uh, from the gallery mm, so i already presented it so here's the thumb icon and you can use the gallery the link for the gallery will be also on my website so you will be able to pick them and choose your own icon that's it i will close this one and i don't need it anymore so down and that's it and this is everything what you really really need and i hope you will be able to just quickly import it to node-red and display it on your device right i hope you enjoyed this video so thank you very much have a nice day or night take care bye bye